Covering news where you live. This is 5 News at 6. Thanks for joining us for your 5 News at 6. I'm Alexandra Burnley. We're just a few days away from the NCAA regionals kicking off in Fayetteville. It's already sold out and at full capacity. Listen to this. More than 12,000 fans are expected to pack Baumwalker Stadium. The university says it's a testament to the commitment and passion of Razorback fans. But just how passionate can a hog fan be? 5 News reporter Jose Carranza joins us from Baumwalker, where you can see that commitment lining up and down Razorback <laughs> yeah, we all know the dedication of a Razorback fan through the good years with championships and winning seasons and even the bad years with the Heartbreak Hogs. We still have many that continue to bleed that Razorback red, but these Hog fans right here behind me are bringing Hog crazy to the next level. We're at capacity right now, uh, no tickets available. Uh, for the, the NCAA regional, and that, and that goes back to the commitment and the, and the passion of the Razorback fans. Fayetteville is home to some of the nation's most dedicated fans. Razorback fandoms in my blood. Blake Taylor is a student at the U of A, following in the footsteps of his parents and grandparents. I'm here right now because I want to get a good spot in hog pen, front row, railing. While crews are setting up bomb walker for out-of-town visitors, the hometown hosts have hog crazy fans hunkering down for the hog pen. It might be some superstition or something, but we just want just the spots that we have sat and watched the hogs all year long. You can be yourself, you can yell, you can scream, you can wave flags, you can bring your drinks and your food in, so it, it's just a big fun atmosphere. A week out from the Fayetteville Regionals, a family reunion is taking place outside Baum Walker even before they'd know that it'd be hosting the regionals. We've all been here for two or three years, so we all pretty well know each other. They're either retired or off work, taking vacation days, etc. Well, I currently, it's summer vacation. The group takes turns saving their spot in line. Their campsite for the week is decked out with fans, couches, even sleeping bags. That's right, they're sleeping on Razorback Road, waiting to root for their Razorbacks. We cook here some, and sometimes we go eat. Uh, I actually have my camper up here at the Roadhog, so I can run up there if I need to. And there's porta potties over here that we can use. I mean, just make yourself a home. And while many go home to rest for the night, or even pass the season, put up their fan gear for the year, these hog fans will go the distance to call those hogs. It is worth it, watching bad in practice. Uh, We've made friends with the center fielder, Tavian Josenberger. Um, you'll see us wearing a cheeseburger hat when he comes up and um, do just simple traditions like um, two down Texas sucks. And if we advance to the Super Regionals, right after Regionals are over, we are back out here. Now, the line isn't exclusive to these hog fans. In fact, they invite more to come out here and join them. They say to just grab your own lawn chair, get in line, because by Friday, Razorback Road may be packed. For now, I'm live in Fayetteville, covering news where you live. Jose Carranza, 5 News.